Hi guys, welcome back to Armor 3. As always, I'm Sergeant Alpha, and today we're going to pick up where we left, left off last time, where last time where we did the, all the prologue. Uh, reality check, common denominator, diplomatic relations, rising tensions, damage control. Uh, today we're going to pick up here with uh, Drawdown 2035, and I'll pick up where we left off with the prologue, and kind of see what happens. Uh, last time, uh, it's after the prologue, it said that the uh, relations were kind of going south with us and the AAF. Though five years have passed since bloody civil war was brought to an end in the Republic of Altus. Thousands of families remain displaced. Refugees scattered across countries around the Mediterranean. The FIA are becoming increasingly desperate as AAF forces... With the U.S.-led peacekeeping deployment coming to an end of its mandate, NATO forces... As millions of dollars in military equipment and infrastructure is decommissioned, opinion is split as to the wisdom of the drawdown. In light of CSAT forces stepping up joint military exercises in the Pacific. The U.S. is keen to reorient its conventional forces, reinforcing the Mediterranean Basin representing a strategic fault line between crumbling European and... The streets of Paris and Rome were ablaze last night as military forces... ...argue that the withdrawal could not come at a worse time. AAF forces begin to consolidate their position on... ...the backing of Canton Protocol forces, equipment and training. ...fire again Parliament was recalled for an urgent debate and a vote over the possible redeployment of British peacekeeping forces. Prime Minister Nicholas Ramsden said he would respect the defeat of his government's motion. Effectively ruled out the possibility of any extension to the NATO deployment in the former sovereign territory. So it's like things are pretty bad all over, actually. <laughs> Pretty good quote, actually. Um, Twenty thirty-five seven seven zero five fifty-five LZ Condor Southwest Stratus. Looks like we are cherry this time. How are you doing? Uh, see where we're going now. I'm gonna checkpoint over there. I thought the 
Well, I'm gonna try not to. <laughs> ben Carey, reporting for duty. At ease. Okay, there's been a slight change of plan. Commander McKinnon requires logistical support down at Camino. He just left as you guys are coming in. Any idea why, sir? No, Corporal. Now take the trucks over there. You should probably get a move on. Understood, sir. Okay. Apparently we're taking trucks, although the roads are closed. Well, but... Sounds like McKinnon needs some heavy lifting down at Camino. I'll drive. You sure you can handle that? <laughs> Fuck you, man. Sergeant Lacey, grab that second truck. We're headed down to Camino. Hold up a second there, Staff Sergeant. Let us get out of your way. Sure, appreciate it. You know, Carrie, the service here sure is excellent sometimes. So I guess we're waiting on the helicopter to move. Alright, take the dirt road out of the camp. Buddy! Well, that's collateral damage, sir. Hearts and minds, sir. <laughs> they need to stay off the road then. So we're taking this nice little scenic drive down through here. Just putting along here. There's a checkpoint up ahead. Slow it down. Nice and easy. We gotta move or Jesus, those greenbacks seem really on edge. No kidding. Yeah, I better give Lacey the heads up. Sergeant Lacey, be advised, greenbacks are really waving their dicks around today. Be on your best behavior at the checkpoint, soldier. You got that? Yes, Staff Sergeant. I'll put on my best smile, sir. You know, I don't even think they even know what they're looking for, Gary. Still cruising along. Wait, is that McKinnon? Shit, stop the truck, Carrie. Broadway, this is Point X ray. Message over. Go ahead, X ray. Over. We lost contact with Camille. I say again, lost contact. No, I want the. Can you confirm? 
He's not breathing. What the hell happened? Staff Sergeant Adams to Camino. Come in. Commander McKinnon's down. Requesting urgent assistance. Over. Camino, I say again, requesting urgent medical support at our position. Commander McKinnon is down. Please respond. Oh shit. Requesting support. Broadway, do you copy? Over. Camino, Broadway. We read you. Wait one. Adams, this is Rogaine. Get your asses back here. Over. Copy, Rogaine, but what about Camino? What the fuck is going on? No but, Staff Sergeant. That's an order. Out. Understood, sir. Out. What the fuck is going on? It'll be safer on foot. Right behind you, sir. <coughs> Not if you say so, dude. Copy that, Camino. Dispatching reinforcements. Just hold on. Echo, we see explosions at Camino. Gunfire across the island. Broadway, give me a report. The situation unclear, Echo. Wait one. Sir, you got any idea what's going on? Not a clue. Sounds like a goddamn invasion. Wait, CSAT? Stay alert! Get set for contact! Try to get this last guy over here. Taking a beating. Let's hope X ray has had better luck. Move it! Move 75. 
25 meters in front. Contact! Carry! Fire at the medic! Front! Medic! 75 meters! Front! Move up! Soldier! 100 meters! Front! Contact! Medic! Come on, hit him! Carry! Engage that man! Front! Well, that's not exactly a good sign. Uh. On the move! I'm behind you, man. Move out! Move 75 meters, front. Area clear. Wait, oh. I hear a chopper. I like how they um, added in all these animals like the snake and stuff we just, just saw and the rabbit from the last episode. Because, I mean, really, in real life, you'd see stuff like that. <laughs> and probably these games, you know, you don't have that. Okay, we're slowly picking them off. Move 100 meters, front! Target down! I don't see anyone else over there. Shit. Echo, fast mover, vectoring on your position. Get out of there. Echo, do you copy? Echo. Now what, sir? <laughs> Yes, it is.
This uh, uh, just took a really bad turn for us, though. Hey, come on, man. Where are we going? Enemy! Terry, engage that machine gunner! Front! Contact machine gunner! Ow! Okay, then. That was not good. <laughs> Move two hundred meters front. Try that again. A little bit better chance there, and uh, I was further back. And uh, Terry, engage that machine gunner. Move 300 meters to the front. Cover me, reloading. Move. Oh, this is really not good. I'm down to nine bullets, guys. Out of ammo. Carry, rearm. I'm just hoping I can make it down through here. But like next to no ammo. So down to a mag with uh, I think three and a mag with six. They're steadily pulling away from me because I'm so freaking tired. Alright, guys, that was the next episode Green on Blue. The next mission, but, um, it's gonna be an episode for us. Hope you guys enjoyed what you saw. Uh, I can see things have definitely took a turn for the worst. Of course, uh, 
were under attack by the guys that we were helping, and uh, our two bases that we were going to and that we were going to retreat to got overran. Our helicopter that was going to fly us out got shot down, and we had to make a run for the forest, and I was down to nine bullets. I'm not sure what our buddy had left, but yeah, definitely not good. So, yes, um, I'm going to try to have the link for my Discord in the description below. If y'all see any screenshots from stuff I do, uh, when I'm recording, or if I'm just on, just have some fun, feel free to check those out. Uh, or if y'all send me a message and saw I hang out, whatever, feel free to do that as well. And if I have time and I'm not working, I'll uh, be sure to try to get back to you. But until next time, I'll see you guys later.